Sherlock is back! This is the intro, bitch! So, just watch my shit! And that's what we'll talk about today, Sherlock's Christmas special, The Abominable Bride. Sherlock is played by Benedict Cumberbatch, and we all know Benedict Cumberbatch is awesome. He's gonna be Dr. Trained, it's amazing. Martin Freeman plays Watson, holy shit, we all know Watson is great. He was Bilbo Baggins. He's gonna be in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, and I like that. I like that even though Sherlock isn't gonna come back on until 2017, that I'm gonna be okay, because we got Martin Freeman in Civil War, and a couple months later, we got Benedict Cumberfucking Batch in Doctor Fucking Strange. So I I am okay with the fact that it's going to come out in 2017, but oh my god, let's talk about this episode. So usually the Christmas special, aka the holiday special, aka the Abominable Bride, is usually like maybe 10 minutes, maybe half an hour, no, 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 holy shit, this shit is an hour and a fucking half, and I loved every fucking second of it, and it was actually really fucking creepy. It takes Sherlock back to the 1800s, where Sherlock actually originated. And I love that it plays on when they first met in the, the series now, and it kind of has lines that have been redone, remade, revisioned, and I love it. It just it makes me chuckle. I, I love it. It just gives them that cute little smile. They're like, okay, I accept this. This is, this is awesome. I want to see the real shit. And that's another thing you can't help but wonder. There were so many hints and clues to Moriarty in this episode that you're like, God, I know what's to come. I want to see what's going on. And you really can't help but think that. But it's just the reality of the situation. We have wanted more since season three ended. And we haven't gotten it for God knows how long. And we get this. And yeah, we get a tiny bit. We get a tidbit of what might come. But we we don't get it all. We do not get a definitive answer of whether or not it is Moriarty or whether or not it isn't Moriarty. We just don't know. But still, this shit is so entertaining. It follows a case that Sherlock Holmes never actually solved. Like, he goes into his mind palace and he goes back in time and solves the case of the Abominable Bride. And I love the way he solves it because it seems like a thing that would happen in the 1800s. The way it happened, the way it worked would seem like it how, how it would be solved in the 1800s. It seems like something someone would actually do in the 1800s. See what I mean? I'm trying not to spoil it for you, but guys, I would totally recommend watching this holiday special. You don't have to know too much about the show from before, but Guys, I would totally recommend watching all the seasons and then watching this thing. And then in 2017, the new season comes up. And this special actually was kind of creepy. Like, I'm not lying. That shit with the, with the wife and the bride and shit, that, that was some creepy fucking shit. And I liked it. I liked that it was creepy. Like, a couple times, I was like, oh, God. Because usually I watch Sherlock with the lights off. Because, you know, Benedict Cumberbatch, Martin Freeman got a ball of lotion. I'm kidding. It, it, but really, it's a good show. I totally recommend it. Each episode is an hour and a half. There are three episodes in each season. There are three seasons. And guys, watch the show. I will review the seasons eventually, hopefully before season four starts up. And I will say that Sherlock, the holiday special for season four, The Abominable Bride, is the shit. This shit is the fucking shit. Hey everybody on YouTube, I have a Facebook page, I have a Twitter page, I have a Google Plus page that I never check, so go ahead and hit that shit. The Facebook page is, you know, Florkurta TV. The Twitter page is at Florkurta TV. I'll put a thing like here so you can see it. The Google Plus page, you get it. Hit that shit, add me to your circle, hit that like button on Facebook, hit that subscribe button here on YouTube, do it all so you can stay up to date with my shit. What should I talk about next? Game movie show, let me know in the comments below. You all got floored.